Hello everybody. Today I would like to share you my top free jailbreak tweak that currently support iOS 12.4. The first tweak here, it will speed up your iPhone. So when you open or close the application, it is much faster and quicker than before, as you can see. Awesome Peg Dot. It is a amazing jailbreak tweak that allow you to customize the dot and change its animation. So when you slide from peg to peg, as you can see the dot jump from page to page and you can change the animation as well you can go to setting and you can choose the animation that you want so I can go to fade so when you slide the dot is fade from page to page and if I change to swap so when I slide so the dot is swap I think this one is a pretty useful tweak that you need also Especially when you have the iPhone 8, when you pull down from the night, you have a page here which show the weather or the player and even the music. And you can set the order as well. You can go to setting and night control. And then you can click on module and you can order it. So you can choose which, which one to show first. So when I, when I pull down, and now the music is in the first page here this one will give you an animation when you lock your iPhone so when I lock it and you can see the animation and you can even change the animation in setting so animation so the first one is reside to center so I can choose the pull up so when I lock so the screen pull up and when I choose pull left so when I lock the screen pull it to the left I think this one is a pretty cool tweak that you need to have on your iPhone 8. So it saw the battery percentage inside the battery icon. So when you want to see how much that the battery that you have left, and you can see right here, you don't have to pull down the control center to see it. This tweak will bring the iPad apps feature into your iPhone. So when you swipe up and go into the multitasking here, you can see the application is arranged like you have on your iPad. Usually when you want to go to Spotlight, you can swipe down to go to Spotlight. But with this tweak, it will replace the Spotlight into the control center. So when you swipe down on the screen here, it will bring the control center for you. And you can access to any module in control center very easily. This one is a tweak that allows you to access to the emoji very easily. So you can have emoji below the keyboard here. And you can also set the emoji that you want to appear below the keyboard as you can see. And you can add the emoji that you like. This one is a pretty cool tweak that brings the iOS 13 volume into iOS 12. The volume hook it looks exactly the same to iOS 13. Usually when you want to go back to the previous page in any application, you swipe at the edge of the screen. But for the tweak, it allows you to swipe to the previous page without going to the edge. So you can swipe from the middle of the screen and it go back immediately. Thanks for watching everyone. Hope you like all of this tweak and I will see you in the next one.